In this video, I'll share my ideas on how to not be a slave and live a free life in modern world. Is this possible? Yes, it is possible. And this guide is highly for tech people because I believe tech people can do it easily, especially the people who really got passion in tech or, you know, in, you got it. So how you can get there? So the first thing you have to understand is that your nine to five job is not making you a slave. Not even money makes you a slave. What actually makes you a slave is the products which you are dependent on. The Netflix subscription or anything which you crave. So when I was young, I really wanted to buy a lot of things and buying things actually used to, you know, usually makes me happy. So for example, if I buy a new phone, I used to get happy about it. If I buy a computer part or clothes, it, I used to get happy about it. But I don't know what happened in past two years. Anything I buy, nothing actually makes me happy. All right. It looks like that I lost my, you know, interest in anything materialistic. I go to a shopping mall and there is no product. All right. I try my best to find something which I really want to buy. But in inside me, you know, I know that there is no product which actually makes me happy. And if you don't understand this, let me give you a, a extreme example. Okay. So PS5. I don't care. Seriously, even if I get a PS5, I, you know, I'm, I might don't not even unbox it for like two, three days. All right. If I'm not in my mood. So this is my current state and I feel so free. I feel so happy because I don't have to like, there is my happiness do not depend on any product. This is something which I don't know how it happens, but I really feel good. So my monitor got a line. It, it is almost damaged right now, but I don't really feel like buying a new one. Okay. Even if I have money, so I have money, but I don't really want to buy, even though it got a line, but I can manage to, you know, use it. So why I buy it? So I got a mechanical keyboard, but this was gifted by one of my friends. So previously my keyboard was really bad. I even showed once on my channel, like it was, um, it was almost damaged. The computer, it's really old and it, it uh, doesn't even have a 1080 or anything. It have a graphic card of 950. So the only thing I spend money on is my mic. And I even recovered it after one year when I made a donation page. All right. But not attaching yourself from materialistic product is something which is really, really important. And you also need to understand we are living in attention economy. So if you understand marketing these companies are trying their best to manipulate you into buying their product so this is why it's really hard for you to you know do not spend money or do not get attached to product because these people are using things like neuro psychology or you know like so much so many tactics and this is why you should also move away from cities because cities are actually First of all, cities are so crowded. I don't know about you, but in India, cities are so crowded that it is not a good place to live in it. Uh, and you might you get so much services there that it get really hard for you to avoid all these services or your dependency on money. OK, but uh, one of my friend actually convinced me that it is possible to live in cities uh, without getting attached to a lot of products and brands. There is a really nice video, not nice actually. I, I watched a video where one girl uh, shared that she earned so much money by selling feed pics and she spent all of it on a brand bag of Gucci. Okay. So this basically sums up today's uh, modern world. Okay. People earn a lot, but they lose everything because they are highly attached to materialistic things, which is, you know, not a good thing to be in. And and this is what capitalism promote too, like marketing and all this. Okay. And I'm not trying to say that do not spend money or, you know, on your needs. So when I travel, I always travel uh, with a flight. I never choose train if I, if it's far because I don't save money. So I always choose more convenient way. Okay. But you need to understand that in capitalist world, you get so much products, you got so much goods. But this is something which comes with a price. Everything have a price tag on it. And in order to afford all this luxury, all these modern elements. So you got iPhone, which got such a new features. But look at the price. This is not for free. So I'm not trying to make you sound like, you know, 
be poor person all right this is actually your method of saving yourself protecting yourself shielding yourself from the modern world even if you get rich someday even if you get money you should be just like how you are you should detach yourself with anything materialistic any product any brand name okay why because if you get rich you possess money this should not affect your nature detachment from materialism is your nature all right and you should be same even if you get money so when you do some job you have to think about it how you can do it more freely so for example in tech you can easily do some remote job so always go for remote job so you can avoid any office culture which is highly dehumanizing these days there are so many jobs which allows you to work from remote which allows you to earn from some you know corporation but do not go to office do not follow their office culture do not participate in their fun stupid fun activities all right so this is a good thing because you can work from some ruler area where you will spend your earning on some local shop owner or your local grocery store and not on some walmart or any kfc or something okay local restaurants so this is actually a good thing to do i also have this theory that a tech person should only work for four hour in a day now this is an average of course like if you someday you might work a lot like entire day and someday so on a week basically you should on an average work for four hour a day okay if you are working more than this then if you are skilled if you are talented and if you got a good profile then you can easily switch to some other job now since you are working remotely you got a freedom of working from anywhere even if some place do not have an internet all right what you can do is if you get a macbook for yourself macbook actually have 18 hours of battery and you can charge it with power bank and you can even charge your power bank with some solar system which you have created so you don't even need electricity because most rural area have electricity problem so all you need is a laptop you can ssh into some server and if your job is just some tech job you can work all right but of course don't forget to install arch linux on your mac and other than that what you can do is that uh, you can have some satellite internet i know it's not uh, here right now in india but you can get it in future i'm pretty sure so it's a one time investment but once you get some satellite internet you can actually share it with some locals and get some money from them this is something which you can do and once you get one internet connection and a laptop with good battery you can easily work from anywhere uh, in this world yeah of course in rural area life will be hard you won't get all the facilities you won't be able to order your food you won't be able to have any services but you need to understand that if you don't like capitalism you have to live a life which was before capitalism you have to reach to the point you have to get comfortable there was no chat gpt and we all were happy coding without any issue but now we got chat gpt and we cannot live without it you understand my point you need to understand you have to cut your dependency on things which you are getting in capitalist world because you understand this is not for free now some people might argue why not just get rich why not just work hard and all these stupid things so so i am not saying that you cannot get rich you can get rich and i believe the only way of getting rich is by doing some business okay so if you do some good business with some real innovation in in it you got a high chance of getting rich otherwise you of course you can get some lucky and get some lottery and all but i am talking about some solid ways okay no investing investing is bullshit there is nothing which can actually make you rich other than you know starting your own business uh, with some good idea and innovation and working hard on it but it is not easy and it is not for everyone and yes it is highly unethical because there are a lot of things your business won't survive if you do not get unethical and if you are confused about it just think about it when you invest your money in some mutual fund or any kind of company do you want loss no so if you understand my point then i i believe like you can get it so being rich is actually good you can try some doing some business and making it work or you can do saving and you are actually going getting little bit rich but you need to again understand that 
capitalism the all the luxury which you see on instagram or social media that people are getting so rich they are basically they can travel anywhere they can do whatever they want but you need to understand that all of this um you know so do not set your goals this big okay so i already talk about this in one of my video just because you see some people so capitalism actually making uh, a lifestyle which is unreal okay you are living in some smart house where everything is automated and it's a um, every small thing uh, is getting easy for you but again it all comes with a price so just think about it if you do not like capitalism you have to think your life in 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 the world which is before capitalism all right so one of my friend actually convinced me that you can live in city without you know spending your money on stupid brands i know it's possible yes you can find some place cheap you know on share but still it's really hard in cities in in some rural area it's easy basically my idea is that do not get attached to product because these products have a price strike price tag and choose a job which actually gives you more freedom and you can only do it if you got skills all right if you're a skilled person you can switch to some another job if your job is you know not so good and you can do some side earning by running some websites or you know doing any kind of uh, youtube or any kind of side work all right yeah so this is it and i really hope that you get good with tech and then you work remotely from some place which is uh you know where you can actually live all right uh, cities are not place uh, not the place where you want to most people i believe who enjoy city life are uh, addicts basically the uh, addict of uh, maybe drinks or you know drugs basically so all right so that's my video and see you in the next video uh, th that was my audio actually what the fuck